Hello ladies and gents, Rook here and welcome to Neuron Films. Today we're going to continue our Final Cut Pro 10.2.1 tutorials and in this tutorial I'm going to cover and show you guys how to apply a border around uh, your clip or picture-in-picture -picture clip or video or image as well. So go ahead and open up Final Cut Pro and go into your uh, library, your event and, uh, and open up your project and here's my project, a tutorial project and uh, within it I have an uh, actual image here I mean a clip and then I have on top of that I have an image that I have that's on top so let's go ahead and move the play ahead right over that clip so you can see both the actual video and the image and you see the picture in picture this is a very sloppy picture in picture it's just for example purposes but I'm gonna go ahead and open up the inspector pane just to the right hand side here and now let's go ahead and add the border the border can be found in the actual effects window you can hit command 5 or simply press on this option right here and it'll open it up Right here, mine opens up some to, to border already, but I'm going to show you guys how to find it here. Um, if you go under all, and you can go ahead and add, go down to this actual search bar and type in border. Now you can find a, several different effects, or um, actually that you may, may be looking for within the effects window here, and I do suggest. Uh, looking for them all you have to do is go to all and then go ahead and make a search for it but here's a simple border if you click on it it'll provide you with the actual border um, preview of how it's gonna look now since I have the image selected it's gonna preview it to that image for example I move my mouse over here you can see the previews on the photo now let's say I have the actual footage selected you'll see the border now on the actual video and if I scroll through here I can see the little Look, now this is a pretty simple border, it's just just as it says here. Let's go ahead and apply this border. We're going to apply it to the actual image. So go ahead and drag it and drop it straight to your image. And I'm going to move the play ahead back over the image so we can edit it. Going into our inspector pane here, we'll notice that if we're under the video tab, we'll not, under effects, we'll notice the simple border was just placed in here. We're going to expand it and see its properties actually. So we can adjust the width through here, you'll be able to actually look on this window here, you'll notice that the actual width of the border is changing. So you can change this as you change this as you please and adjust it. I'm gonna go to a view up here real quick and uh, actually I'm gonna yeah okay it is on fit. I just it just seemed a little small, but um, there you are. You can adjust the width. You can change the color. Let's go to red, and then uh, the mix. This is basically the opacity or the transparency of the actual border if you don't want it to be like too big but there you are there you have it and then also you can add keyframes to every single one of these if you would like to for example let's say you wanted the border to disappear after a certain time this is where keyframes come in hand and be sure to check out my keyframes tutorial on how to use and take advantage of those but that's the basics of a simple border thank you guys for watching catch you guys next tutorial and later so let my